What's going on guys? Before we get into the video, I have a big announcement, a big channel update. If you guys didn't notice, I'll go ahead and point it out for you, but the channel has now been renamed Riggs Gaming. Uh, so again, I wanna thank you all for the love and support. Hopefully you like it. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. And the very first video with the new name to the channel is going to be uh, beyond epic video this one coming from Jesmic who just took on Macedone in their CWO are getting the victory too But wait until you guys see this attack uh, Very very excited to bring it to you often when we see these 9v10 triples I mean they're rare. I mean they're rare all by themselves, but when we see them It's usually some form of a lolo but check this out, guys. This one coming from Wiro Sabling. This is going to be a Falcon attack, the hottest attack strategy still in the game going about a month. Uh, it's been about a month now. Uh, and you guys are going to see how powerful this attack is. If you haven't tried it, definitely go ahead and give it a try. Uh, and this is a fully maxed out Town Hall 10. All the defenses, all the walls, everything. So go ahead and break down this attack for you guys simple funneling over there on the right hand side uh just using a wizard very very cheap funnel while the archer tower is distracted on the enemy queen wizard's gonna go ahead and take out all those buildings over there. he's even gonna get that storage he's gonna go ahead and get that barracks we have a baby dragon again just another wizard up on the top uh created a, or took out enough trash buildings so that baby dragon would target the elixir storage from there he would take out the mortar Queen's going to go ahead and it's going to take a little bit of time to be on this town hall. But because this attack strategy, because it is such a bum rush into the core through the base, you don't have to kind of rush anything. You don't have to really rush your funnel. You don't have to really rush uh, the kill squad. It just everything just kind of goes right into that core, completely annihilating the base once you get that funnel set. So you're going to see King coming down. He's going to be dropped over there at 9 o'clock. Uh, Queen taking a lot of heat from not only the Expo, but from the double cannon. Plus, uh, once the double cannon went down, the Queen goes ahead and aggro's the enemy King. But with those healers under rage, you're going to go ahead and take out the enemy King. No problem. And you guys can see set a, per a perfect trail to lead the Bowlers and the Valkyries, leaving up that Elixir storage. And you can see that Tesla went ahead and dropped down two hogs to take out that Tesla over there at about 930. The key is keeping all the troops inside the core of this base. And again, guys, it doesn't even look like it. I shit you not, when you watch this attack, it straight up looks like a Town Hall 10. You wouldn't even know it wasn't a Town Hall 10 if you didn't even if you didn't look down at the troop bar. I mean, this is exactly how it goes. 10v10, but this is a freaking Town Hall 9. So all spells have been used except one. One you have to pay close attention to, that being the Skelly spell. Wait till you guys see how Wiro is going to go ahead and use that. There it goes. Skelly spell is going to easily take out that Archer Tower. If you guys look closely, the Expo is actually being tanked by the Queen. And once the Bowlers take out the Bomb Tower inside the core, all defenses can be reached over the wall from the queen there goes the skellies they take out uh the expo they're gonna go ahead and beat through the wall to go ahead and take out the king altar and look at this you guys of course there was a hound in the cc but look at this queen's gonna take out the tesla she's gonna go ahead and take out the wizard tower skellies take out uh that bk altar incredible attack i want to give a big shout out to everybody over in jesmic for telling me about this attack for inviting me over i was so happy to bring it onto the channel to show you guys this this beyond epic 9v10 three star but that's going to do it for the video um like i said in the beginning of the video the channel has now uh become rigs gaming i saw a lot of comments from the previous video so i want to i appreciate all the feedback and love and support uh from you guys could not do this without you it's incredible how fast this channel is growing and it's because of you cannot thank you enough i try to say it as much as i can in my videos um but we're having a lot of fun i'm very excited for the future of the channel i hope you are too um but that's gonna do it for this video if you guys liked it make sure you guys go ahead and leave a like if you're new here go ahead and subscribe comments questions or concerns down in the comment section below and the channel is now rigs gaming see you guys in the very next video